So in an interview this past week on KTLA, we saw you, Michael Moore, talk about the trust of the community and how much that is valued by yourself and LAPD. But at the recent hearing for LAPD's data-driven, evidence-based policing, we heard very strong statements being delivered from the community, the black community specifically, letting you know how they feel about that word trust in your mouth and letting you know that the trust is not there. We also saw you, Michael Moore, at that meeting, sit and listen as your own LAPD presented lies about the predictive policing programs, PredPol and LASER, and you said nothing. And you still haven't said anything about that. They sat there and lied about the programs at the hearing that was centering data-driven, evidence-based policing. But you want to get on KTLA and talk about transparency and how that's valuable yeah. to you and the trust of the community. Yeah. Also, the community, specifically the Stop LAPD Spine Coalition, um, in a community-driven effort, has demanded the release of chronic offender bulletins. And we demanded this through the Public Records Request Act, and you have denied that release. And for folks in the room who are not aware of what a chronic offender bulletin is, this is a secret bulletin that the LAPD has been creating on individuals in different communities since 2011. And these bulletins have a description of a person who has done nothing wrong, but is being targeted by LAPD as someone who has the potential to commit crime. And they are thereby tracked, they're, this bulletin is handed out to patrols and circulated, and it is used to justify the surveillance of these folks. There are over 800 chronic offender bulletins that have been created on folks since 2011. We have filed for the release of these reports, and you have denied that request so far, and we are fighting you in court on this. So you're going to sit there and talk about transparency? We next speaker, please. Who's next? Go ahead, go ahead.